Hey, Rashawn, first off, how's the ankle? I'm all good, all good. A little tweak and uh, get some treatment on it and be right back, ready to go. Awesome. Well, the the team is now 4-0 and in games where six or more uh, of you and your teammates score uh, in double figures. What does that say just about this team and its identity overall? I just, when we move in the ball, you know, it's a, it's a much better team, a much better team, uh, much harder to guard. You know, we uh, did a great job of moving the ball around. A lot of guys got touches, a lot of guys got shots. And uh, we got a lot of good looks. We passed up, you know, good looks for great looks. And we were just on the string playing well together. And so, uh, yeah, I think just when we move the ball, we're a very, very tough team to guard. Sean Cunningham. Hey, Rashawn, knowing that what you guys had come through the past two games where the offense looked particularly bad, to have 30 assists tonight and then come off that speech from Harrison, both – not only how good to see your team respond, but what were you thinking when De'Aaron goes down so early? Are you thinking like this just happened at the wrong time for you guys? I mean, you know, you never want to see anybody go out. You know, uh, De'Aaron's our floor general and, you know, we, we need him out there on the floor. But at the same time, you know, we had to step up, you know, next man up mentality. And Tyrese came in and did a great job for us tonight, you know, in his first game back. So, you know, I think just, you know, strength in numbers here and we have a lot of depth, you know, so when things like that do happen, we have guys ready to step up and ready to get out there and get the job done. James Ham. Hey, Rashawn, you, you brought up Tyrese there. Uh, what is it about him that just seems like it's not even the stats, it's just the way he looks on the floor and you guys have instant chemistry. He's setting you up for those lobs and you guys are really just – it seemed to have chemistry instantly. Oh, yeah, he, he just brings a different swagger and, uh, you know, a different feel to the game. You know, he understands how to play, understands where his looks are. You know, uh, in the pick and roll, he's very, very tough to contain. You know, he, he knows the right time and to make passes, right time and to go attack the rim. He's just a very, very savvy player. And uh, like I said before, it's a joy to play with him and uh, get a chance to play off of him. You know, he, he, he sets us up pretty well. So I love playing with Ty. Jason Jones. Hey, John, just getting back to the guy, the way you guys have played to start the season, just was it early in the game, could you tell that, okay, we're getting back to where we, we need to be and moving the ball the way we need to to get things rolling? Hey, you know, you could tell. You know, you could tell. You could feel it. You know, when the ball's moving, the energy in the gym picks up, you know, everybody's energy picks up, you know, and we, we made it a concerted effort to make sure we did move the ball. You know, it's something we focused on. And to go out there and execute it, you know, it was a good game plan. And we did a good job of coming out there and getting good looks. You know, we shared the ball. And like I said, we're a tough team to stop when we do that. Anderson. Hey, Rashawn, nice one for you guys, man. Um, how much did you you guys need this? This, you know, not just a win, but, you know, to kind of feel good and, and feel like you played well and uh, did the things that, that you've been emphasizing? I mean, it's just great for our mental, you know, to come back and respond after, you know, a little three game slide, come back out and respond the way we did, play the way we wanted to play. And, uh, you know, we can play like that going forward. You know, it proves it. You know, just have to continue getting better, continue looking for our looks. And, uh, you know, we understand how we need to play. And hopefully we can go out there and execute and do more. Ryan Cunningham. What did you see from, from you and Marvin that made you guys so effective tonight? I mean, just aggressive, just aggressive. I mean, Marvin is a load to handle, you know, and he's so ridiculously talented. You know, he draws so much uh, attention from the defense. And, you know, he just had a great game. He was aggressive, went out to the boards, you know, and did what we expect him to do, what he can do every night. You know, Marvin's a great player, and we're just going to continue getting better as we learn how to play off each other and learn how to play off our teammates. And, uh, we're just going to continue to get better. Last one, Matt George. Oh, Rashawn, going back to last season, you you know how loud the Golden One Center can get with 18,000 fans. Obviously, there's not uh, that home court advantage, but this is game one of a seven-game homestand after the 0-3 road trip. Is there still some sort of advantage being on your home floor in your own building this season? I mean, I think just being able to be at your own house, you know, uh, go through your own pregame rituals, things that you normally do at home that you can't do on the road, you know, it adds a little something for players. And, you know, I can't stress enough how much we miss having the fans out here in Golden One Center. But even then, we can still feel the support. We can still feel the love. So it's always an advantage playing here, we feel like. And, you know, we just have to go out there and continue to try to protect home. All right, last one, James. 
Hey, Rashawn, one more. Hey, uh, you talked about you and Marvin figuring out some chemistry and working some stuff out. You guys tonight had 30 assists as a team. Uh, you tied your career high with five assists. Is that what you're seeing? Like there's just moments where the spacing is better, where the game feels better between you guys? Almost definitely. You know, like we, we, we haven't played together a lot. And, uh, you know, it's a learning experience for both of us. And so just learning how to play off each other and things of that sort, I think, as the games go, as we watch film and just learn each other's tendencies, you know, we're just going to continue to get better. Like, I think the game we had tonight is just literally the tip of the iceberg. You know, there's so much we can do together. And as we continue to play and continue to get our chemistry going, it's nothing but up.